I would describe Rocky as tireless, as absolutely committed to whatever he is doing, as incredibly creative. He can write, he can sing, he is a fabulous teacher. He's a carpenter, he's a painter, he's a mechanic. I, there's, there's pretty much nothing that Rocky can't do. I was on a farm in southern Illinois and was raised in the great outdoors. And so I spent most of my time on a tractor or outside in the fields hunting and fishing. This is really an extension of that for me. What I've loved about being in this place is to be able to just share the things, you know, my hobby, my dreams with people. And we have kids that come up here, and adults, that have never thought much about anything other than the little bubble that they live in. So to take children who have never seen the Milky Way or have never looked through a telescope, never seen Jupiter or Saturn, and to share that experience with them, it's like every time it happens, it's the greatest thing in the world. He's a very pleasant person, very positive about how to get things done and very positive about interacting with people. He's a good old boy at the same time as he's a skilled astronomer. I mean, he can connect whether you're eight years old or 80 years old. It's not often that you can do something with someone who, that it changes their life. And when we can show someone Saturn through the telescope, when they see the rings of Saturn, they see the moons around Saturn, they realize they're seeing something a billion miles away. It changes their whole perception about life and our place in the universe. Although there are hundreds of billions of stars and hundreds of billions of galaxies, I'm the only Rocky Alvey in this universe. And there will never be another one like me and there will never be another one like you that has had the experience of observing the universe the way that, that we do. And that's a thing people occasionally think about, but being in Dyer Observatory, having the job that Vanderbilt's offered me, the greatest job in the universe, I can think about the universe every day. Every day I drive up this hill and I think every second's precious that I'm up here. He loves this place and he loves the university and he loves what he gets to do. And he's always doing lots of things. He's juggling, but you know, he never drops a ball. We just couldn't do what we do without him. I think the commitment and the devotion that Rocky has to Vanderbilt really should be and could be and I hope will be an inspiration to everybody who works here. I'll just give you a line from my favorite folk song. It's called Mud and Sunshine. And one of the lines goes, My pappy said that life is like a river. You can sit and watch it roll from the muddy banks. Or you can dive right in and have yourself a mighty swim. Have a reason for a smile at the pearly gates. So I think diving into this job at Vanderbilt, the Dyer Observatory has been one of the most wonderful things of my life.